Hello, my name is Kevin Fitzpatrick, Storage and Data Protection Practice Lead at Com Solutions. Today, I'd like to show you the NetApp On Command Management Console installation procedure. Please note that I've previously downloaded the On Command Management Core install from NetApp.com. In order to install, double click the installation file. You have the option to install the Standard Edition or the Express Edition. The Standard Edition will have a lot more features included than the Express Edition. You can refer to NetApp's documentation to know exactly what the differences are. For this scenario, I will be installing the Express Edition. Go ahead and input the license key and click Next. following screen, select the installation folder and then click install. Once the installation is completed, you can click next to continue. On the following screen, you can check off the launch management console box and click finish. A web page will appear that will prompt you for credentials. Put in either domain admin credentials or local server admin credentials to authenticate to the on-command management console. The on-command management console will automatically browse your network to discover any SANs that are running in your environment. And I should preface that by saying any NetApp SANs running in your environment. Once you've logged into the on-command management console, you'll see a brief dashboard, which gives you a general health overview of any filers that you're that the on-command management console discovered during the login process. At this point in time, it has not picked up any filers in my environment. Go ahead up to File and select Download Management Console. This will actually download the software needed to install the Management Console plugin. You can select the operating system you'd wish to install. For this environment, I'll be installing a Windows operating system, and I'll go ahead and save the download. Once the download has completed, you can go ahead and click Run. This will launch the installation for the Management Console 3.1 setup. Go ahead and select the directory in which you'd like to install the software. Click Install. Once the installation is completed, you can click Next, and then Finish. The management software will then load. You can go ahead and log in using either domain admin rights or local server rights. You've now successfully installed the NetApp on command management console. Within the dashboard, you can see if successfully picked up the filer in my lab environment. I'd like to thank you for taking the time to review this video. Should you have any questions, please feel free to email me directly. It's kfitzpatrick at comsolutions.com. And please also take note that on our website, you can review these videos and other blogs from our other practices. Thank you.